Hello everyone, it's Latified again from YouTube and today I'm going to be showing you guys how to make a custom YouTube profile background image. So a YouTube template. So what you're going to do is on the right side you're going to see a template and I'm going to have you download that. That's going to be a PSD and you can open up with Photoshop. So once you download that just open up Photoshop and open it up. Now what you're going to see is this as you can see all you have here is a background and foreground which we're gonna edit to make it to your liking so the first thing you want to do is edit your background so you're gonna right click it you're gonna blending options next you're gonna click gradient overlay and you're gonna double click on the gradient here you're gonna have two switches and you can change them to whatever color you'd like it to be so I'm really going to quickly going to zoom out by doing right click magnifying glass right click fit on screen and you're going to see everything so we're going to go back to our foreground blending options oh sorry background blending options gradient so you can mess with the colors whatever you want to do I'm just going to do a let's do a blue so a light blue to a dark blue and there you go so as you see here we have a little nice gradient and now let's edit the foreground I'm gonna make this a grayish color to fit in with the blue so let's make dark gray and a light gray alright so there you go now we have the color as you can see so we're going to zoom back in and we're going to take out our text tool and you're just going to write your name or whatever you want so name here and what we're going to do here is we're going to move it by rotating it so you're just going to click on the corner and just drag it hold shift so it's a good drag and you're going to end up with something like this now type whatever you want and just press the arrow key to get rid of it uh, now you can use your movement tool and move it to wherever you'd like we're just gonna set it to here and now we're gonna do the same thing but this time make the font smaller and you're just gonna write your slogan again this is just a basic you guys can go crazy and do whatever you want and we're just gonna put a slogan so now we have your name, your slogan, and the template with the color. Now what we're going to do is we're going to put a little picture or whatever you'd like. Um, you can use brushes as well. And just go crazy. Do whatever you guys want to do. Um, what we're going to do though is we're going to make it so it looks like light is coming down from the top. So take out your brush tool go to your brushes and do basic brushes then we're gonna take out a 100 size brush we're gonna make it 150 pixels actually and make sure you made your new layer and set your opacity up top to 25 now what you're gonna do is you're just gonna click up here and you're gonna click up here again so it kinda looks like light is kinda fading in as you can see you can make it more obvious by doing a larger size brush and maybe even picking up the opacity if you like just play around with it whatever you really want to do so right here we have 37 opacity with a 298 size brush which looks pretty nice alright well guys thank you very much for watching if you guys have any questions or comments please post below and have a good day